three-point shooting day would be in their favor. Dallas Graziani able to end. He's got a steal, and Jaden Campbell has two more. On the weekend against Furman, he's a big-time shooter as Rylan Jones answers on the paint, but nowhere to go. Campbell hoisted up and puts it. Hicks had his mid-range, Jay rejected, but right to Riley Allen's back. Averaging almost a double-double this year, had been quiet early. Jaden Campbell hits a deep three. Be a confident team, I'm told, and they know what they're capable of and are sound in their fundamentals. So adding a win at home against that big rival was a validation. Gets a post touch here. Nice cut, AJ Staten. Wofford taught star to slow down and they've turned it over again. Campbell gives Sanford. Here at Hicks. Lucas Walls, the true freshman, powers it up and in. Coming off a game where he had a dozen against ETSU. He's got 13 already tonight. Whistles. Graziani fires again. Hits again. Dallas Graziani by a couple. Yeah, Sanford's not shabby either, though. They're 12 on their 19 mage buckets. <laughs> Cormier, another three-point make. He's got four tonight. Garrett Hicks has an answer. Sanford, a chance to tie or take the lead back on this trip. Hicks again. He's got another point of this second half. Hicks off the high screen, fires away, and connects. A defensive possession for Sanford that time, no openings. And Jones goes coast to coast. Filowicz down to the box against Achore, who stoned him, right? A three-on-three -three break, Achore, a deep post catch, and finish, and a foul. Jones along the baseline, inside, what a catch from Achore. Locked from behind, but a foul. Was called on Sybil's opportunities. Bailey along the baseline, turned it over. Garrett hit two seconds left. Trip for the tie. It's good. Trying to get free. Inside at shore. Lays it in. Timeouts. The hoist at the horn is no good. And Sanford survives. Wow, such a great play. Ryland Jones does.